The Optical Wireless Communication Conference, a new edition, is coming up and it will be held in Eindhoven in December. The main theme will be 6G. I see two main tracks there. The communication to do towards the end user, where all the optics and the communication part will also be in the smartphone, but also the backbone, the front halls and, and so on. Now, in these fields, we see a lot of ambitions. And if I look to the long range communication, it's quite often about bits per second, just like a speed race, the Max Verstappen example of going faster and faster. But to miniaturize it and to get it into photonics integration, there may be a lot of other challenges. Jürgen van Erps, you are on the program committee, on the technical program committee. In photonics, it's not only about bits per second, but there are many challenges. Yes, indeed, Jean-Paul. I think uh, there's uh, many things to take into account, uh, not only uh, pushing as many bits per second as possible through the through the system, uh, but also uh, looking at things like how to steer beams, how to shape beams, and there's different approaches to miniaturize everything on a photonic integrated circuit. And there has been many uh, recent developments in that field of uh, trying to put as many optical functionalities as possible on the chip. But we often see that uh, if you have to interface the chip with the outside world, that uh, additional micro optical components uh, can uh, provide added value to uh, to further uh, increase the uh, the um, the efficiency and the functionality of the interface with the outside world. Um, so that's one of the um, one of the things where where uh, there's still plenty to explore. Yeah, we see quite often that things really take off go into a mass market when there is something like a dominant design. But in photonics for optical wireless communication, I see a kind of dominant design for satellite communication, a big mirror, um, the incoming path and the outgoing path coincide and there is a kind of semi-transparent uh, um, mirror in between to separate these paths. But in miniaturizing it and flattening it and make it really fit for consumer products, there is not yet something like a dominant design. Or would you see it already? No, that's true. Uh, there's still plenty of uh, approaches that are being explored and I think it's still uh, unclear what will be the, the, the winning design. Huh? Mm -hmm. um, so uh, yeah, still still uh, unclear what, what the, uh, the final thing will be. You're on the technical program committee of the Optical Wireless Communication Conference. What would be the kind of papers that you would really love to see here? Why would you see the breakthroughs? Uh, is that in a system architecture or are that in specific components? Well, uh, as there is no winning technology yet, I, I assume that there can still be uh, new approaches uh, presented on the component uh, level. But of course, the, the system architectures uh, are as well very uh, welcome to, uh, to, to submit and, uh, and, and be presented at the conference. Yeah, and then certainly we are looking forward to have a nice, very inspiring conference in December this year in Eindhoven, the Optical Wireless Communication Conference. Thanks, you.